just go and look around about these islands. It's fantastic. It's a fantastic place to live and work. I think the environment that our salmon are raised in is superior compared to other parts of the world. The, the farmers love the animals. They, they want to check on, their, on the well-being of their animals. It's, a, it's extraordinary. We have a massive advantage that our factory in Marybank that is producing the fish is only 1.4 miles down the road, which again is ensuring we are producing the freshest possible salmon that we can. We're doing traditional curing. Yeah, we do salt and sugar mix, so it's an amount of salt for that size of fillet. The salt is hand massaged into the fillet and then placed gently onto a rack. It's an artisanal product, somebody has to know that inside out and somebody has to be adjusting and tweaking and checking that smoke product at the end of the day to ensure that we get consistency of product. A traditional kiln is a kiln that will be allowed to age and mature over time. Primarily it will add flavour. We use whiskey oak shavings. The whole process of curing, smoking and packing, everything has been done by hand, everything has been checked by hand. It means that we have a lot more control in what we are producing and how we are packing it. We can spot all the issues that might not be raised if you were doing things mechanically. So I really believe that it gives us more control on absolutely everything we do inside of the factory. I had somebody come up to me while I was outside and told me that it was the best smoked salmon that they've ever had. As a chef, it's great because you've got all this amazing produce right on your doorstep. All the hard work's been done for you in the making of the salmon, and we're really lucky in that respect. At the end of the day, we're giving our customers a really good product, and seeing the customers happy, that's the best part of the job. Yeah, I can see success with the Harrison Lewis Smokehouse, and we're going to be making the best smoked salmon in Scotland.